Hi everyone, in this video we're going to go over the difference between a pipeline, a job, and a task. Let's start with the pipeline. The pipeline is a business process that your firm does. So for example, you may do corporate return, annual 1040 return, monthly bookkeeping, and a lot more. Each of these processes or services requires a different set of steps for that service to be completed. Now, let's get into one pipeline here. A pipeline is divided into stages. These are various steps that must be undertaken to move a job towards completion. So the number of stages actually varies on your business process flow. So you may have different stages for corporate return and different stages for individual return. Through each of these pipelines, you have job cards that progress from left to right. So you can see exactly what the status of each job is. The overall function is to help you easily track the progress of similar jobs, while allowing them to run smoothly towards the end of the pipeline. Now, these are examples of a job. Let's get into one of these. By the way, jobs can have tasks from within it. So a job is a much bigger picture item compared to a task. And as the job passes through the stages of the pipeline, you might need different employee to perform different things. And anything that is created through automations will automatically get linked into a job. Examples of these are invoices. As you can see, you would know exactly the status of the invoice, how much the amount, contracts, organizer, and of course, task, which can be assigned to you or your team members by clicking on the assignee drop down here. You can also change the status if it's in progress or completed. Tasks are actually your to-dos that you and your team needs to perform in order to complete a certain job. Now, you can set up your pipeline so that each time a job enters a new stage, automatic actions are triggered. Now let's try adding a job to this pipeline. To do that, let's click on add job at the upper right side of the screen. Under accounts, there is a drop down you can select or you can type in the name of the account you want to add. Below that is the job templates. There is a separate video discussing job templates and how it works. Below that is the job assignee where you can assign this job to a team member and let's click on add. As soon as you add the account, you will be prompt of the automations that will trigger. Now, as you can see here, an intro email will be sent to your client right away. Invoice will be created, organizers at the same time, and tasks will be created for you or your team members to perform. Now, you can directly assign this to someone else and click on move. Once you do that, a name card will automatically appear on the first stage of the pipeline. And that's it for pipelines, jobs, and tasks.